This past weekend, we stayed at the Homewood Suites in Flamingo Crossings. Homewood Suites and Home 2 Suites are next to each other and share the same outdoor amenities. Currently nearby, there are a variety of other Hilton and Marriott hotel properties. This hotel is 10 minutes from Walt Disney World via the Western Gate and easy access to all the parks, whether by car or rideshare. This hotel opened in February of 2021 and has 226 rooms, free parking, free breakfast, free Wi-Fi, and no resort fee. We stayed in room 639 that overlooked the beautiful pool area. We were able to select our room on the floor plan via the Hilton app. That was nice because it allowed us to pick a room that wasn't near the elevators or ice machine. This kitchen was a great bonus too and had all the necessities for a short or long stay. Next to the kitchen, there was a small dining room with a table with two chairs. The table had wheels on it so it could be wheeled over to the couch for more seating. In the living room, there was a great love seat sofa bed and on either side, two lamps. Our room overlooked the lovely resort style pool that was open until 10 p.m. daily. In front of the sofa is an ottoman that easily moves around, and on top of that a nice little side table to hold my laptop or a coffee. The large king-size bed was okay, it was a bit on the firmer side, but it had those down pillows that really didn't give any head support. The TV was nice though, it was on a swivel mount so it made watching TV in bed very easy. It wasn't a smart TV, but it had about 50 channels. As far as storage goes, the dresser had three drawers and an open shelf, and each nightstand had one drawer and one open shelf at the bottom. Each lamp, as well as the alarm clock, had American outlets and USB ports. The bathroom vanity had a large lit mirror, decent storage, and a selection of Neutrogena bath products. Keep in mind, there is no door into this area from the bedroom, so if you get up in the middle of the night and you turn the light on, everybody's waking up. In the closet, you'll find an ironing board with an iron and plenty of hangers as well as extra pillows and blankets for the pull-out bed. The shower stall is large and the shower head has a bunch of settings. Above the toilet is a shelf with towels. Taking a closer look into the kitchen, they had a Cuisinart one cup coffee machine with a variety of coffees and teas. There is also an ice bucket where you can use the ice machines that are across from the elevators on each floor. Paper towels can be found in the ample cabinet space. There is also a microwave and a two burner electric cooktop. and surprisingly, a full-size fridge and freezer. You may notice the cabinets are empty, but that's because everything is currently in the dishwasher. Everything has been cleaned prior to your arrival. Out our window, we saw the very top of the contemporary, and this view would be great for seeing fireworks. In the back, they also have RV parking. But in addition to that, the outdoor amenities are even better. You'll find a resort-style zero-entry pool with a water slide. Between both hotels, you'll find a patio with barbecue grills and two separate fire pits. This was quite a popular place at night, but didn't see any hours posted for any of the fire pits. Right next to this area was a very nice outdoor bar that was open until 10 p.m. and a food pickup window. During the week, their free breakfast goes until 9 a.m., but on the weekends goes until 10 a.m. They even have make your own Mickey waffles. When Flamingo Crossings is completed at the end of 2021, this hotel will be right across from all sorts of shopping and restaurants. We learned that there will be a Publix, Target, 
Walgreens, and a variety of fast, casual, and sit-down restaurants. Homewood Suites is a quick Uber ride away from Disney Springs and everything else that Disney has to offer without being in the hustle and bustle of the heavy tourist areas. This was a great hotel to stay at not only just for one night, but an extended period of time and is great for families. Please be sure to like and subscribe for more travel content. Thanks so much for watching. Please let me know in the comments below what you would like to see next.